lesson, we will begin to look at the new language curriculum from a broader view. In the last video, we looked at the overall structure and the context. In this shorter video, we will look specifically at strand A. Strand A is an overarching strand that focuses on literacy connections and applications that will enable students to transfer skills and draw on knowledge from each of the other strands, other subjects, and wider contexts. In strands B through D, students integrate strand A expectations as they develop and apply their understanding of strand-specific concepts. This chart illustrates the relationship among all four strands of this curriculum. These four learning strands are uniquely related in this version of the language curriculum. In all grades of the language program, the learning related to strand A takes place in the context of learning related to strand B, strand C, and strand D. Strand A should be assessed and evaluated within these contexts. As we explore the strands in later sections of this module, we will talk about connections among and between strands. We will now look more closely at strand A, literacy connections and applications. This strand focuses on students applying the seven transferable skills in language and literacy contexts, developing digital media literacy skills, and applying language and literacy learning in other contexts and engaging with texts that foster understanding of diverse identities, experiences, perspectives, histories, and contributions. In all grades of the language program, the learning related to this strand takes place in the context of learning related to the other three strands. In overall expectation A1, students apply the seven transferable skills. These skills include critical thinking and problem solving, innovation, creativity, and entrepreneurship, self-directed learning, collaboration, communication, global citizenship and sustainability, and media literacy. In overall expectation A2, students develop and apply digital media literacy knowledge and skills to support their learning. They learn about their rights and responsibilities when interacting online and developing their digital identity. Learn to navigate online environments while managing their data, security, and privacy, including seeking appropriate permission and use digital and media tools to evaluate information and demonstrate their learning. They learn and apply the conventions and techniques of digital and media texts and analyze the relationship between text forms and content, audiences, and creators. They use digital and media tools in the design process to develop innovative solutions. Students learn how to interact and contribute to an empathetic, respectful, and inclusive online community. In overall expectation A3, students learn how to develop and apply their language and literacy knowledge and skills in their daily lives and in cross-curricular and integrated learning contexts. As they explore the concepts of identity, self, and sense of belonging, and the lived experiences of a diversity of individuals within various communities, including those in Canada, they can further develop an understanding of their own unique identities. By analyzing themes and texts of various forms from First Nations, Métis, and Inuit individuals, communities, groups and nations, students can also develop their understanding of First Nations, Métis, and Inuit identities, perspectives, relationships, legacies, and ways of knowing, being, and doing. These are the overarching concepts and themes of the language curriculum. As stated previously, strand A should be assessed and evaluated within the contexts of the other three strands of the language curriculum. Both the context of the entire curriculum and the overarching concepts of strand A set the stage for all other literacy learning. Thank you for completing lesson three of the Foundations of Language Learning module. Thank you.